technologies. I mean, I could, I could in theory demolish this fishery as well, if Poseidon's just going to wreck all of them. What do you need, Perseus? Okay, we need to finish the Sanctuary to Athena, we need two more pieces of sculpture. Okay, well, we've got two sculpture there, so we need... Well, I mean, if we ask for three, we'll get five, so we'll be quite close. And we've got quite a bit of money, so we might be able to afford it. He says... Oh, oops, something's popped up. Uh, four sculpture, four marble and two sculpture. All right, because I send the olive oil, he's very happy. Yeah, so people should be sending stuff their way. There's a sculpture. Okay, one sculpture, one sculpture, four marble. So we're just waiting for the for the for the other sculpture to arrive. Oh come on! When I actually want you to sell me sell me more, you sell me the exact number. Boo! <laughs> yeah, so we want another three. Hang on. No, we want two. Actually, we want to get up to six. So I will. No, I don't want six. I want. No. I want two. I want two more than we have. Or, or not. You know, that's perfectly fine, I suppose. Right. Yeah, uh, guys, uh, prioritise the temple that would give us what we need to finish this mission. I know selling is good and money is fun and all that kind of stuff, but actually, yeah, yeah, he's got the right idea. Oh, drop one down. The Arbor of Athena is complete. You have drawn the great Athena, goddess of warriors, crafts and wisdom to your city by honouring her with a sanctuary. Inspired by her very presence, your city's soldiers have grown stronger. A grove of olive trees has sprung up near her sanctuary, and she herself has promised to help the city defend itself from both internal and external threats. That's good. And now we've now we need more workers. Um, are there any businesses we don't need? Oh, we don't need them. We don't need the wine industry anymore. Because that's the only place I was using it for. Aha! Brilliant! No unemployment. Just, oh, 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 oh. That's everything. Ah, oh, it's the fleece. Probably because I've deactivated the fleece industry. Nope, no, nope, just the fleece. Shepherd people are incompetent. I need a lot of marble for this guy. Okay, what, what industries are we close? Uh, oh dear, if we open that, that's going to be a bit of a problem. Let's do that. Oh, we, need, we need 50 more workers. Um, right. Huh. So I think so. Now it's just kind of we need fleece. Uh, yeah, we need to, we need to double how much fleece we have. Double the fleece we have. Get on it, dudes. Um, so husbandry has to be priority. I know well, that's only seven, though. That's the thing. I mean, relative to what we need. Oh my goodness! Stop! Stop it! Stop taking the things I need. How much we got? We've got two. We've gone from eight to two. Half wondering about whether to. Okay, first of all, maybe we should stop selling it. Stop selling it at the moment. No, keep selling the marble. I mean, that's all we're using the marble for. How much marble have we got? We have 14, 20. We don't need more marble. So we can switch that off. We'll open the fisheries again if we're running low on food. And I think... Your city is now worthy of Perseus' presence. Right. Send for Perseus! And, and we just lose, I mean, yeah, yeah, you're paying everything, so. I might open, open, I might build some more fisheries again. That they will, they'll, they'll end up being destroyed. Let me an no, I can afford that one. 
Do it to one I can't afford. No, we don't need the. We don't need grapes. Zero work is needed. Good. It's a nice round number. We have a load of wine that we're probably never going to use. Ah. There's Athena. Uh, what do we get? Da, 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 da. A successful prayer to Athena yields olives and olive oil from her sacred grove. Oh, we, we've got more than enough olives and olive oil. The city doesn't have enough food. Yes, that's okay. Uh, yes, let's stop selling the cheese then, shall we? We can start selling fleece again. I'm happy to sell fleece. Just don't sell cheese. We need food. Ah, <laughs> oh dear. Right, what are we doing? Oh, we're, we're waiting for Perseus to show up, aren't we? Yes. And then once he shows up, we will start... Aha! Bring on any challenge and I will face it down. There he is. Maybe the Grii had it right. What's the use of having a mouthful of teeth when there's no food? Hey, we've got food. Potentially. Probably. Um, so I think, first of all, we'll uh, send him to get Athena's mirror shield. Uh, because, well, we've got that. Well, we've got Athena on side. We've got her temple. Um, and then we'll send him... I answer to no man, vassal or no vassal. Uh, okay, so he's talking about the city. So he's like, there's no food? Yeah, we're, okay, we need more food production. Um, maybe where can we put a fishery that's remotely safe? Maybe yeah, maybe up here might be a good place. Nope, that's one. There's another good place to put it. Uh, yeah, we need more employees, but the thing is, we also need more food. So now. Yeah, we're making a lot... Just by doing that, gives us a lot more food. So I think there's something wonky with this. Hmm. Okay, it's just dropped down to a slightly more sensible level. Slightly more expected level. Um... I don't know why I did that. Oh, Perseus is heading down to Tainarum. And then once we've done that, we'll send him to the... Uh, to get the Helmet of Invisibility from Hades. From Hades. So yeah, I mean, at this point, it is kind of just waiting and trying to... How wonderfully wise Aha! you are! You completed my quest. The mirror shield will help you and Perseus through difficult times ahead. To celebrate, you may now construct a, com to construct a commemorative monument dedicated to me, the wise goddess Athena. I will now send him to get the helmet from Hades. And we now have uh, a small Athena statue. Which I won't place yet. We'll, we'll hold on to that. We might use that later. Um, do we need more, do we need more food? We've got stored food for eleven months now. We we'll probably use up on one of them. Yeah, well, I mean, we could probably stop producing fish. I mean, we've got a lot of cheese. Any minutes. And I will bring you more joy than any other god. Others throughout the world will think more highly of you if you worship me, and any blessing another god can grant you, I can grant you too. Yes, yes I, I kind of, I, I think the end of this campaign is going to be me building the, uh, the sanctuary to Zeus to deal with Poseidon. I, I might be incorrect there. That's just my guess. Happiest monument available. Yay, people are happy now that I can feed them. Um... Yeah, this person is just going back to Tainarum. Tyr is on a quest. So hopefully he'll get that and then... Bizarre! Ooh. Father and daughter. Um, yes, Athena's popping up there. This doesn't seem... sensible. I wonder if it's GOG or if it's... Perseus has obtained a shiny shield and some fine headwear <laughs> that will prove invaluable to him and to you. 
Argos's stature is continuing to rise, but for the city to reach its apex, you must again expand its borders. It would be wise to establish this colony in an area of the world distant from your first colony, to avail yourself of the resources of different regions. Your two colonies, however, will be so far from each other, that their only contact with each other will be through Argos. Okay, so next time we're going to be um, colonizing another place. I think it's Miletus is going to be where we will end up. Thanks for watching, everyone. Thanks for watching.